Good morning. My name is David Anderson. I'm the senior pastor here at Faith Baptist Church. And on behalf of the whole church family, let me welcome you to our morning service. We are so glad you chose to be with us. If you're a guest, we'd like to have you fill out the guest card in the back of the seat in front of you so we can get to know you a little better and reach out to you to see if you have any more questions about our church or how we can be of service to you. Or you can go directly to our website and hit the Guest Connect button and you can register as a guest there. Until then, please enjoy the service and may God bless you. We offer lots of great opportunities to grow friendships and dig deep into the Word of God. Join us every Sunday for our 10 a.m. worship service via on campus or live stream. And on Sundays after the morning service at 1115, we offer our pastor's class. This is a class that digs a little bit deeper into subjects such as church history, biblical doctrines and theology, just to name a few. This month, I'll continue covering Old Testament survey. And just about every day of the week, you can find a study group taking place either here at the church or at a member's home in and around Sarasota. If you're between the ages of 18 and 29, our crossover study group is the group for you. This group meets every other Sunday at 6.30 p.m. here at the church. Our next meeting is tonight. So come on out for a great time of fellowship and an in-depth study in the Word of God. Wednesday nights, our adult Bible study begins at 6.30 p.m. here at the church. Pastor Joe is currently going through the Book of Acts. Our Wednesday children's and youth groups are taking the summer off and will resume in September. On Sunday, July 21st, we'll be heading over to the Bolero in Sarasota for another fun night of bowling together. Lanes are not reserved, so be sure to get there by 6.45 p.m. Visit our events calendar on our website for more information and to register to participate. And did you know that you can go to our website anytime to listen to past sermons and classes? Just visit fbcsarasota.com to access these and more. You can even read some of Pastor Joe's book recommendations, view our weekly pastor's blogs, or just look around at the many other ministries we offer here at FBC. On behalf of the staff here at FBC, we just want to thank you for joining us. Good morning, folks. Faith Baptist Church is blessed to have the opportunity to support over 60 missionaries and missionary projects around the world. One of these faithful missionaries is Jonathan Connerup, who was a missionary in East Africa for many years, but now has a worldwide ministry as the mission director of the Baptist Bible Fellowship International. Here's Brother John explaining the 938 Project. I'd like to quickly tell you about the 938 Challenge. What is it exactly? This is a challenge and command by Jesus himself found in Matthew 9, verses 37 and 38. Those verses say, then saith he unto his disciples, The harvest truly is plenteous, but the laborers are few. Pray ye therefore, the Lord of the harvest, that he will send forth laborers into his harvest. Basically, Jesus is saying that we should plead with the Lord of the harvest for more people to go into the harvest. You can pray for the unreached people groups. Some unreached people groups number in the millions, and yet, have not a single known believer in Jesus. This should shock us because their destiny is eternal punishment away from the presence of the Lord. So consider going into the harvest by pleading for more people to go and tell them of the gospel of Jesus Christ. So then, the challenge is to pray every day at 9.38 in the morning or 9.38 in the evening. Set your alarm on your phones or wherever at home to remind you to pray this important prayer. It's a simple prayer, really, but one that Jesus commanded us to pray. It's going to require so many more to bring in such a huge harvest. Eight billion people on this planet now. Would you join us? Asking God to send more? 
and then pray for those that He calls, that they would answer that call and say, Here am I, send me. No matter how you look at it, to bring in the harvest, we need more laborers. The point is this, we need to see as Jesus saw and feel as Jesus felt so that we will do as Jesus did. The 938 Challenge, will you join us in prayer?